Hello, everybody, and welcome to Harry Potter Quidditch Champions. This is the first time I'm putting my hands on it. I hope you enjoy being here. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you do end up liking it. Make sure to click that subscribe button if you like this video, like past videos, and want to see more in the future, and want to see more of this game. Please put it in the comments below. Thank you so much. Let's get into it. As young witches and wizards, we all dream about soaring through the sky like our favorite heroes. <laughs> By Harry Potter, Harry Potter, Harry Potter, oh, Harry Potter, Harry Potter. Sorry. To be the next Quidditch star. Ooh. Defeat my toughest opponents. Good gracious. To keep my composure when it matters most. To chase my dreams at any price. To seek glory for my team. Oh, what a transition. Day, that dream could become a reality. Why does this just look like a Fortnite creative mode and game? The road won't always be easy. Ooh. But if you just keep getting back on your broom. Yeah, the animation and graphics look very Fortnite. And trust in your teammates. Quidditch is magic. Is it magic? So ask yourself again. Do you have what it takes? Uh, I don't know. Do you have the heart of a Quidditch champion? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, we get to create a character right away. Okay. Um. Hmm. Should I make it kind of look like me? Um. None of these are great. But we'll click this one first. Uh, we're going to keep them tall. Look, Mom! You made me a sweater. That's what it says. Customize your character. Okay. Alright. Uh, oh. Uh, oh, sorry about that. Mm hmm. Uh, I don't know. Because I kind of... Maybe go with that. And we'll go with a paler skin. Yeah. Ooh, bottle frame. Uh, bottle fame. Complete a career challenge. Oh, okay. Uh. Oh, eye color. We need to make those blue hair color. Um, dark brown, light brown. Let's go just with brown. Uh, they them. I'm a I'm a he him. That's me. All right, and so what hair do I want? I'm going to definitely do a shorter hair. Ooh, maybe maybe that. Mm, ooh, no, let's go with that. That works good for me. Yeah, uh, no glasses, I don't think. So we got starting gear. It says four out of four, so if I click on that. Oh, okay. Oh, I like the orange. Ooh, okay. I don't mind that. I like the orange, I think, though. I think I want to go with the orange. Yeah, we don't want to go school uniform. Yeah, let's go with the orange. You customize your character later in the team. Okay. There we go. Hopefully it saved, because I did see it change just then. Hopefully we'll be good. Champions journey has to start somewhere. And for many, yeah. That's in our own backyard. Is it? In our minds. The garden is a grand Quidditch pitch, and wind blowing in the trees is a roaring crowd. Can you picture yourself playing among your heroes? Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah. The Weasley Burrow Garden Cup. Fight! Flight is what it says. Flight up! Start your Quidditch career by mastering your broomstick basics. Okay. Here I go. Welcome to our backyard Quidditch pitch. Okay. Before you take flight, let's make sure you're comfortable on your broom. Rest comfortably in the saddle, and double-check your grip position. Okay. Oh, okay. And then climb up. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm surprised it's not backwards. Can I change that? Can I make it to where my 
steering up and down is inverted. I've always been a fa yeah, yeah, yeah. I, th I think I think that'll be better. Fly backwards, okay? When you think up, the broom should do exactly what you want. If flying doesn't feel natural, try some adjustments. Uh Yeah. Okay. I just got to get used to it. Oh shit, fuck. Sorry. Mm. Press triangle to invert up and down flight. Can I though? Okay. You could always invert up and down in the settings. Maybe I do want to change it back. There are a lot yeah. On the Maybe. Mastering your evasive flying will keep you out of harm's way. Okay. Oh shit. Okay, cool. You can really push your broom for an extra boost of speed. Uh, cool. Okay, gotcha. I'm understanding, I'm understanding. I think you're ready for something a little more advanced. Okay. Drifting will let you fly in one direction while looking in another. I use it all the time when lining up a shot on the not bad. Looks like you're getting the hang of it. Am I? Definitely better than Neville's first time on a broom from what I heard. Here's a quick challenge to really see what you can do. Okay. Fly through the rings, okay. Doing that right now. I think I'm okay. It's feeling all right. Feel like it could be better. I. It could just be me though. Like, oh my god, I can't believe I just did that. I have to go back and get those two that I missed. Ugh. Okay. All right. Did it. There's no rush to move on until you're comfortable. Brilliant. I'm good. Whatever. Then let's brush up on Quidditch, shall we? Okay. It's really not all that complicated once Okay, Jedi. Sorry, that was force gump. Each team has three chasers. They're the heart of the Quidditch team, if I do say so myself. That okay. That is called Quaffle. And a chaser's job... Quaffle? Well, chase it. When do you like quaffles? Yeah, I like quaffles. Get it back at all costs. And bring it towards the opponent's goal. And working as one... Throwing the quaffles through any opposing goal scores our team points and brings us that much closer to victory. Gotcha. I'm I'm awful at games. Tackle opponents and score goals. Okay. Quidditch is fast paced, and you'll often need to change your approach quickly. Oh, I see. Just a change in perspective is all you need. Okay, so you have to okay. Swap roles. As a chaser, your main concern is the quaffle. Have a look for it now. Did I locate the quaffle? Quidditch is first and foremost a team game. When you find yourself in an advantageous position, let your team know by calling for a pass. Okay, triangle to call for a pass. Now that you've got the quaffle, don't forget about the rest of your team. Individual talent will only get you so far. Right. But truly great chasers know they need to pass to their teammates. What? Oh my god. Okay. And then... Where the fuck did you go? Why do you keep moving around so much? There we go, okay. Is that right? I did it. Always be on the hunt for the quaffle. If an opposing chaser has possession, that can easily be resolved with tackle. What do I... Okay, and then okay. Okay, R2. Impressive work so far. You've proven you can score in an empty goal. But they won't always be Let's Yeah. You can slip one past the keeper. Okay. That about does it for the chasers. Oh. It says complete chaser match? training. Yeah, I'm ready for a match. Say that. Let's go chasers only for this first map. Okay. We could do that. Whatever you want. It's your game. Oh, I could create another character? Oh, what do I want this one to look like? Oh, I'll make this one look like my wife. Uh, okay. I mean, as much as I can, because there, there's not very many options here. Um, yeah, there, uh, sure. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah. No, none of none of these are great. Um. Ew. There, that's fine. Pale. Yeah. Eye color, blue. Right now she kind of has like a, a burgundy hair, but it doesn't look like that's an option. So we're gonna just go with the light brown as well. And she, 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 sure, she, her. Okay, let's see if I could find a good hairstyle for her. Mm. Mm. Not really, none, none of them are great. Ponytail's cute. Oh, like none of these are right. What is this one? Oh, you, what? Um, I mean, I, I guess this will work. Glasses. Yep. And then we'll, what do we want to do? Yeah, I guess we'll just go with the... We'll go with the blue for her. Her favorite color is teal. But... That'll work. Yeah. That wasn't her! But cool, we have, we have two new characters. Your favorite pranksters and Quidditch players. Yay, look at you! Yay. Cool. Here comes the bludgers. Okay. Go, 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 go. Freaking go. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Where's the, where's the quaffle? Oh, it responds in two. Okay, and shit. I didn't get it. Damn it. What am I? God dang it! I suck. Oh, we we scored again. Okay. Where does it respawn at? Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh damn. Okay. There we go. And huh. wow. I don't like the way this controls, but. Maybe I'll get better. That's the end of the match. Perfect timing too. I think the numbers are back again. What a match. What a match. Cool. We got we got done with the Chaser Weasley Cup. Ooh, career frame. Or career fame, my bad. Okay, continue. Next match. You're natural. Thank you. Very first match, but it was well earned. Thank you. Shall we challenge them to a rematch, or are you ready to learn more about Quidditch? I'm ready to learn more. Continue. The keeper adds, "Oh, okay. and I think my brother Ron will be the best person to fly." Okay. Sorry, I skipped that a little bit too quick. I should have listened to it. All right, so this is the keeper. So I'm going to make my oldest daughter crystalline. We'll do this. Yeah, and then we'll just do... Yeah. None of these are great. Ew. Whatever. They're, none of them are great. <laughs> we'll do that one. Blue eyes. Light... Mm, yeah, let's do that. Light brown. And she, her... Let's see what kind of hair we got. See if there's anything close to what she likes. Not really. Hmm. Because th this is more Kyrie style. You could just... 
That's cute. Uh, half up, half down, kind of. Oh, uh, we could just do that. That'll be fine. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Go back. Fuck. I didn't mean to do that. Ah. Uh, little. This one. That one. Blue. Okay. We're going to do... Hmm. Yeah, we'll just do that. Uh, she doesn't wear glasses. We're gonna change this to pink. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, continue. Crystal and will be the keeper. Quidditch would be rubbish without the keeper guarding the goals. A good defense can make all the difference in a match. Your team's keeper has one very important job. Stop Ooh. that quaffle from going through any of your goals. Yeah. A good keeper requires the tactical mind to predict where the quaffle will be shot and the agility to stop it. Right. With their vantage point, a keen keeper inspire and guide their chases as well. It may sound hmm. like a lot of responsibility, but nothing beats the feeling of single-handedly saving a goal. Yay. Let's see if I'm any good at this. Chasers can play a decent defense, but to properly guard the goals, keepers have their own way of moving. More like a hummingbird than a hippogriff. Okay. Try. Left, right. Okay. Okay. Diving is an We're okay. Keep to learn. It lets you move quickly and accurately between the goal rings. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Easy. Cool. I'm not mad at that at all. Oh. Oh. There we go. Okay. Not bad. As a keeper, it's important to know where the quaffle is at all times. Don't forget to keep focus on it when you need to. I wish... I wish you could just click on it. Job is simple in theory. Stop the other team from scoring goals. It's trickier in practice. Chasers will try and trick you, so keep a close eye on them and be ready to move. Your team depends on you thinking on your feet. Ooh. Broomstick, in this case. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Don't doze off back there. You've still got a team to help. From here, you've got the best view of the happenings on the field. Show us your leadership skills and give your team some guidance. Now let's take a look at your play calling from the chaser's point of view. Flying through auras will give you a speed and energy boost. Ew. I don't like this. Okay. A keeper's kick is an indispensable tool. You can use it to deflect quaffles and bludgers, or you can even give other players a good whack to drive them away. What? Let's give it a go. Try and save this next shot on goal by deflecting it with a big kick. Okay. There we go. Did it. What you need to know is a keeper. The keeper, that's me. Play a match with proper defense. Uh, okay, I'm ready. With the keepers added to the game, things are about to get a lot more interesting. Sounds good, Ron Weasley. Fine with me. This is the Weasley Twins. Excited to show. Hello and welcome to another Ew. thrilling game of Quidditch. Hey, it's us. Molly Weasley. All right, let's see you. Fuck! Why do I suck so bad? I don't understand perspective. Oh. It's okay. She spots a chance. She Perfect! Yay! Select the keeper. Wow. I don't want to be the keeper anymore. Oh, 
go like this. Got it. There we go. Oh, what? What am I doing wrong? Oh my god. Oh my god. I hate this. Oh my god. There we go. Does it matter which direction I shoot it from? There we go. I got it again. Respawn, respawn, respawn. There we go. Right in. Ugh. Why do I look so much more tan than I did earlier? Perfect timing too. I think the gnomes are back again. Oh no, not the gnomes. Let's see if we can get a word from our women. That's me. I did it. Wow. Now I could be the beater. Moonstones. Gold and moonstones. Cool. Let's continue. Thank you. Offense and defense are both crucial on the Quidditch pitch. Okay. Now, shall we move to the next lesson? Or are you itching? Brilliant. Let's go to the next one. Move on to the roles that make Quidditch truly unique. Starting with the beater. Better find someone fearless for the job. I know Fred has been giddy to go over this bit. Or was that George? Ooh, now I'm going to make my youngest daughter. Uh, Kyrie. There. Blue eyes. She's blonde. Um. Hmm. Is it like that? Is that a light blonde? Ash blonde. Yeah, let's go with light blonde. That works. She's a she, her. Uh, and we're going to do the... We're going to do the ponytails. Where is it? Where's the ponytails? Am I just missing it? There we go. Okay. And then we're going to change this to the black. Continue. Yay. Kyrie's going to love it. Beaters. You either love them or hate them, depending on which side of the bludger you're on. What are bludgers? They're iron balls that are fast, aggressive, and enchanted to knock players off their brooms. A beater's job is to use a bat to drive those nasty buggers away from your team. Or theirs. What could be better than seeing your opponent set up a perfect play and totally ruining their plans? Ooh, not a tooth. Dang, that's intense. Launch metal balls called bludgers and tackle opponents to stop them from scoring. Okay. The chaser isn't equipped to deal with bludgers. For that, you'll need the big bludgers and nasty little buggers. And can cause a lot of trouble if you're not careful. A lot of new beaters start off okay. real with the injury. So let's take it easy to start with. Okay. Cool. Drifting isn't just a chaser trick. Beaters can do the same. Often the devastating effect. Quidditch is an incredibly physical game. Every hit will knock you off balance. Take okay. too many hits, and you'll be tumbling off your broom. What? When okay. all fails, you can just pretend you are the bludger and tackle your opponent. Really? Did that work? I'm assuming so. Okay. Okay, now what? Close with a distance. And then what do I click after that? 
Okay, boom. Then why can't I summon it? Let's knock them off their broom. Same as last time. Send a bludger their way while they're still off balance. Okay. Maybe we should worry about that. Just a little bit. I'm not I'm trying. There we go. There we go. Dead. Oh, you disappeared. Spectacular. Fred and George would be proud. Now take what you've learned and master it. Knock everyone on the field off their broom. Okay. Doing it. There we go. There we go. Good. Was that it? Eliminate the keeper. Where's the keeper at? Let's eliminate the keeper. He's so far away. There we go. Hit him. Can I... Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, can I just freaking wail on him? I can. Perfect. Now that you understand what a beta does... You'd made a fair beta. Uh, sure. Okay. Okay. I wish I could say that I'm enjoying this, but I'm really not. Better put on a good match or we'll have you arrested for trespassing. Look at all of us. Only joking, of course. Or are we? Wow. The up. I think I'm going to be a beater. Let's see if I could... No, okay. We're going to go back to being a chaser. Oh, no. There goes the shot. Where? Ah, stop. Beater. Boom. Oh, so like I got to do all this set. Oh my God, this is a lot. That's a fumble. No. Fuck. I suck. Oh my God. Yes! Go! Go, Thomas! Go, Thomas! Go! Yay! God, I'm not enjoying this at all. There's so much on the freaking map. There's so... Everything's so ugly! Okay... How do I do this? Ah, uh, there's too much on the freaking ground. Uh, like, I don't know how to get down there. Is it? Get it. Right here. Where the fuck is it? There it is. Eyes on the prize seekers. Eyes on the mother fucking prize seekers. Eyes on the mother fucking prize seekers. Oh. Fuck you! There we go. Can I pass it? Yes. There we go. Keep moving it down there we go. Passed it to the wife. And... Huh. Got it. Good God. Porks off ploy. What is that? That means assist a goal by shovel passing to a teammate shortly before a score. I wouldn't say that was shortly before a score, but okay. Oh, I got it. Yes. Yes. Ah! Oh. oh, good God. I freaking suck. Oh. That's the end of the match. Perfect timing too. I think the gnomes are back again. You Remember, keep saying that. <laughs> awesome. Ooh. 
More moonstones, more gold. Oh, oh, a broom of some sort. I should have looked at it better. Phew. Nothing like dodging blood just to get your adrenaline going. Okay. How did you fare? No broken bones or brooms, right? Right. Play another match before we bring spend that. Let's just continue. Learn the last piece of the Quidditch puzzle. The seekers and the golden snitch. I'm not <laughs> There's already so much stuff. Younger seeker in a century. So, I'll let Harry handle this one. This game's so claustrophobic. phobic. So claustrophobic. I'm so claustrophobic. God fucking damn it. Oh. Uh, so, what am I gonna do for this one? I am... I'm going to make a second version of myself. That's what I'll do. There was a long-haired version of myself at one point. Which one did I do before? It don't matter. This is a, this is a different version of myself. Still with the light brown hair. Still he, him. I did have my hair that long at one point. Let's look at medium, see what... No. No, my hair was never that long. Uh... Yeah, maybe just do that. Yeah. We'll do that. We'll do the middle part thing going on. And... We will use this outfit. Okay. Two versions of myself out there, and then the Every rest of my family. Their job is to find and catch the elusive golden snitch to score big for their team. Okay. Said than done, as it's the size of a walnut. I suppose they don't call it seeking for nothing. Right. Aside from sharp eyes, better have sharp reflexes too. Because once you find the snitch, you'll also need to chase it and grab it before the opposing seeker does. If you can stay mm -hmm. close to the snitch, anticipate its movements, and dodge a bludger or two, you can actually hold victory in your hands. Okay. Could actually hold victory in your hands. Seekers are entirely focused on the golden snitch, an elusive golden ball. It's tricky to find and even harder to catch, but gives your team a load of points. When Usually, you'd need to find the snitch first, but for now, we'll just focus on the fundamentals. Okay. We'll get a chance to play hide and seek with it later. Okay. The is famously hard to keep an eye on. Stay focused to avoid losing track of it. Okay. I wish that I could just press it. Why do I have to hold on to it the whole time? Keeping up with the snitch can be difficult, but using those gold rings will let you fly faster for longer. Okay. I don't really like this, but okay. Seekers need to be quick and agile, making tight turns at a moment's notice. Drifting is an excellent way to make those tight turns. This time, you'll need to find the snitch yourself, and quickly, too. You won't be the is only that one looking for it when we're actually playing. Keep your eyes open for a glint of gold. Listen out for the flitter of its wings. I fucking hate this. Like, I, I, I thought I was going to at least enjoy it a little bit, but, like, it's making me actively upset sorry boost get it get it get it this is some bullshit oh my fuck you and the fucking ass stupid piece of shit snitch Fuck you, snitch. Ugh. God damn it! Ah. So do I just keep going through these rings until that gold... There we go. Did a little bit of a drift there. So I have to go through enough rings to make that, that gold all the way up, is that right? You're almost there. Stay close to the snitch and keep it in your sight. Grab it when you're ready. Yay, I just got 30 points. Ye frickin' haw. And 
with that, you know everything you need to know. To well, the youngest game. seeker in the century. Are you ready for your first real match? I guess. This one is for all the gobstones. Okay. We're playing with full teams now. So. <laughs> it's already so overwhelming to be good with. Twins, your favorite pranksters and Quidditch players. Greetings from the commentator stand. This oh. is Ginny Weasley. Okay. Why does it keep skipping it? Here comes the bludgers. Oh, you know what I just thought about? Damn. My voice is going to be on here twice because I forgot to turn it off for both games that I just recorded. God. Uh, that's so annoying. I hate that. Wow. Yeah, I'm so irritated right now that I recorded like this. The away team steals possession. Yes, keep moving it downfield. There we go. Oh. Are we going further than... Damn it. I'm so irritated with myself right now. Got it. Eyes on the prize seekers. What a great pass. Can I just have the fucking thing, please? Chaser lines up the shot and the keeper blocks the goal without breaking a sweat. Wow. Yeah, so basically I record with my my audio but or with my with my microphone, but when I do online play with my buddy Jeremy, I turn my microphone on for the recordings for um for my headset and that that audio is really really bad. And now I, I recorded both of these videos she takes a chance. with the map has reached the halfway mark. Has it? So I'm kind of irritated with myself, is all. Okay, come on. I could get it now. The there we go. Yay! Catch a snitch without getting hit by a bludger. And catch a snitch in less than 120 seconds. Okay. She takes well done, there we go. Good job. That's the end of the match. Perfect. Man, I wish I would have remembered that before the end of the. This has been your dynamic duo. Complete the Burrow Cup. Saying that you don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. <laughs> Next item, next item, next item. New customizable unlock room. Wow. 
Cool. Loadouts. Proceed to ceremony. Thank you. We did it. Wow. Now that was Quidditch. The speed, the teamwork, the danger. It's all so thrilling. Thank you. A resounding victory. I don't think any of them saw that coming. You've really earned our illustrious Garden Cup. Thank you. We found some spare brooms lying around if you wanted them. Gave them a quick dusting and everything. They may not look like much right now, but given some time, I'm sure you'll be able to unlock their true potential. Well, I'll be honest with you. I don't know if I'll play this anymore. But if you want to see any more and things go well, um, make sure to leave in the comments below. Like I said, I'm really sorry about the audio situation. I don't know if I, I'm going to be able to put my audio over here properly or I don't know what I'm going to do. It's going to take a lot of editing. But anyway, thank you so much. And as always, I will see you next time. Goodbye.